start up in Google Drive by creating a new form. And set a title for it. Don't really need to bother with a form description. We go for the first question and set that to short answer. Name that location. Then we'll add a second question. Call that avatar. And we'll set that to short answer as well. Then we head into the responses tab and link a spreadsheet to the form. We can get email notifications here, um, I don't bother. And we go back to the questions tab and preview the form. And we look at the address up in the form and capture from the d forward slash through to the forward slash before view form. Paste that into notepad or whatever you like to use. With the number that we use or the key that we use to define the form. And we fill in an answer into location and avatar. and submit the form. Close that. Then we go to the Responses tab. Go to Individual. And right click and select Inspect Element over the Location Answer. And here we'll see a number after Entry dot. That's the number we're going to grab. That relates to the location input. And we right click our avatar answer, go to inspect element, and after the entry dot, we grab that number that's going to equate to the avatar entry. We'll close this down. We'll just check the spreadsheet and you can see that those entries of location and avatar have been entered on the spreadsheet from the form. Okay, let's hop out of Google Drive and go into Open Simulator. And I've got those notepad entries on a note card. So let's go to edit what's going to be a recorder. I'll put the recording script into the sprim and open it up. And I'll copy and paste the first key into this part of the script. Copy and paste the location key into this part of the script and copy and paste the avatar key into this part of the script. Next up I can choose here whether to report the grid name, the region name and the parcel name by setting them all to true. If I leave all of them false it will report the parcel name. 
Then we scroll down and we can put some floating text for the prim that we're using. So in there, just something like visitor recorder or you might want to inform your visitors you are recording their presence. Then we have three other variables we can set. We can set the maximum number of avatars that will be consigned to memory. Um, that memory in this particular script is cleared when the sim gets reset in Kitely. And we have a scan distance which is the range from the prim as a radius and then we have the frequency of the scan. 10 seconds is plenty. You can do it more often if you want to. And there you can see the prim with visitor record of the text I wrote in sitting over the top of it. Now we go back to Google Drive and open up our spreadsheet and you can see here there's a timestamp, there's the grid, there's the sim and there's the parcel name and my name is Avatar. We'll get rid of this entry now, don't need that there anymore. And we go and look at the actual form itself. See there's two responses now. For location and avatar. And we can clear these responses. Deleting them does not delete them from the spreadsheet. So I'll just clear that occasionally. And then we see the entry still sitting in the spreadsheet itself. If you do have any problems setting up, pop a comment in this post and I'll try and answer your questions.